guys, you ready for some more doom? I'm not. <laughs> this game is fucking scary, man. But I'm a survivor, so let's do this shit. Well, well, just to add to this, they are forcing me to go after gore nests. <laughs> Damn! We're about to encounter, like, a lot of big groups, man. Four to be exact. <laughs> got an interesting fact for you guys. I found out that, well, as you know, or you may not know, there are 13 chapters in the missions, and the game was released on Friday the 13th. Coincidence or not, right? I thought that was kind of cool. Fuck, I had him, but no, no, no. I had to fall down the steps. Damn game. That guy was tough, man. He's got some armor. And I have to admit, they do a exceptional fucking job of hiding these secrets. I am gonna have to come back, because I'm one of those OCD type people with having all the secrets and stuff. So it's kind of pissing me off that I've been missing a lot of them. So yeah, I'm gonna have to come back and find all those secrets. Because I only found like one in the first mission. I don't think I got any in the last mission, and at the moment, I have none in this mission, so they do a really good job, because I've been exploring, 
and I keep thinking I'm finding secrets because when I'm looting stuff off the guys I like automatically think it's a secret I'm looting but turns out not to be. Okay well that did nothing so I guess uh, it must be part of something we got to do later. Because I don't imagine it's just sitting there for no reason. Yay! Funny part is if I had made the jump, I wouldn't have gotten it. Because <laughs> I wouldn't have approached this guy. <laughs> Sometimes fuck-ups are good. I'm just going to hold on to my points here because I want the equipment system upgrade, so... And that one takes two, so I'm just going to wait. I'll hold out until I have two. Yeah, I'll just take your arm. It might be good for beating someone senselessly in the future. Uh-oh, danger approaching!
And do any of you guys even bother with the maps? I haven't really felt I've needed the maps because, well, you see the little doohickey at the top that's showing you more or less where to go? That seems to be so good that I never need the map. Like, they did an awesome job on that direction thing. It's so easy to follow. So yeah, let me know, like, I don't know, maybe maybe later on in the game, maps are in need, I, I don't know. You're seeing pretty much my entire gameplay, so what you see on here is as far as I've gotten at the moment. Well, that's a cool weapon. I like that weapon. That was fun. Oh, damn, I can't pick it up on that.
Yay! Weapon upgrade! Shit, that was a fucking close call, guys. Close call, man. I thought I was gonna take a death there.
Yay, we did it, guys. We did it. Fuck, I have like no balance. <laughs> Always falling down from places. Die, fucker, die! Oh, what the fuck? I can't jump up there. <laughs> if I were aim properly, I could have, but... It's like a madhouse here. I got no time to waste jumping up on places. If I can't make it, I just gotta keep going. It's a survival race. I made it, guys! And a little off topic, but it's kind of suiting with, you know, all the fire around this place. But my arm hurts like a fucking bitch today. Because this past weekend, I had a pretty busy weekend. Friday I swapped my streaming, it's usually on Saturdays, and I swapped it to Friday because of all the shit I had going on for the rest of the weekend. Then Saturday I went to a football game. Yes, to many of you, you're probably wondering, football? That hasn't started yet. Well, I'm in Canada, so it starts a little earlier for us. It works out perfectly, actually, because um, I'm a huge NFL fan, right? So by a time our football's done. NFL's starting back up, so it's 
pretty cool. But anyway, so I was streaming Friday, and then Saturday I went to a football game, and I was outside for like, I don't know, six hours, and I'm one of those people that don't prepare for that shit, so I didn't like put tanning lotion on or wear a hat or any of that crap. I just wing things, right? <laughs> So that's that. And then the next day, I was going to this thing. It's called Pork Palooza. I'm actually going to be doing a video probably, I don't know, probably Saturday. I'll talk about it and share some stuff that I kind of took clips of while I was there. But it's this event because over here there was a thing that happened. Uh, it's a place I used to work at actually called Fort Mac. And they had a huge fire, and it, I believe it killed two people, which isn't too bad. Two deaths out of tons is not too bad. But a lot of people lost their houses. So it was more a charity event, and, um, and like I said, a barbecue, and then a concert. The biggest reason I wanted to go on the Sunday, because it ran all weekend, but I wanted to go on Sunday because the people performing was Prism, Headpins, and Loverboy, which are three bands I haven't seen in, like, a long time, because they're a lot older now. They're not, you know, we're not talking about Avenged Sevenfold here or anything. They're, they're from, like, the 80s or something like that. So, I was outside for another probably six, seven hours. So, Saturday at the football game, I didn't really notice it too much. But last night when I got back, yeah, my arms are like beet red. And yeah, they just hurt. So, that was a, a short story made long, but yeah. So my arms kind of hurt a bit today. <laughs> Back to the game, which is about to end anyway. And in case you're wondering, because at that particular part, you're like, why do you have, or you're probably wondering, why does she have her screen so dark that she couldn't see those mobs? Well, the reason is because when at the beginning they were saying, light in so you can see, well, that made no sense to me. This is doom. You know, it makes more sense to me to have things dark because the whole reason I like to play these games is because I hope they will freak the living crap out of me. So when it comes to like survival horror type games, I like like, don't get me wrong, I'm not going to put it as dark as possible, but I definitely don't like a whole lot of light in it. I believe that these games should be dark. So anyway, that is the end of this chapter. Yes, once again, no secrets. Fuck, I don't know what's wrong with me, man. But, oh well, that's the way it goes, I guess. We will see you in the next chapter. Bye, guys.